Travis Barker has finally gotten his senses back and realized that his daughter, Alabama Barker, needs to be tamed. The way she has been behaving on social media is not mindful, not cutesy, and definitely not demure. Unfortunately, it took the birth of his son with Courtney, Rocky, for him to see that he didn't exactly raise Landon and Alabama right. This has sparked some serious controversy as people have long accused him and Courtney of treating their almost one-year-old son as the only kid that matters, despite both of them having kids from previous relationships. Now, many are saying that his sudden realization of failure as a father is just a cover-up since Alabama seems beyond saving. This whole situation is so messed up and we have to talk about it. Grab your popcorns, loves, and without any further ado, let's get right into it. Just to clear the air, I don't give a f about how nobody feel about me. Keep feeling it, bitch. If you've been following the Barker family drama, you already know Alabama Barker has been wilding out on social media for way too long now. And it looks like daddy Travis Barker is finally putting his foot down, or at least that's what we're calling it. So Travis Barker recently came out and talked about how much he regrets the way he raised Alabama and her brother Landon in the spotlight. Like we're talking major regrets. In an interview with the Wall Street Journal, Travis said that if he could go back, he would have done everything differently when it comes to raising his kids in the public eye. Imagine being raised on reality TV with cameras in your face 24 seven, your every move filmed for the world to see, which was the reality of Alabama and Landon in Meet the Barkers, the family's old reality show that aired when Alabama was literally born on camera. She had no chance of living a normal life from day one. One And Travis knows it now. He was looking back at how his older kids were raised in contrast to his and Courtney's one-month-old Rocky Barker, whose face they've refrained from showing the public. He said, and I quote, if I could do everything different, I would have done the same thing with my older kids. Travis went on about how it's weird for kids to grow up and realize their whole lives were shared with the public. I think it's weird to grow up and you're 15 or 12 and you're like, mom, why did you post this of me? No, seriously, it is a super awkward moment. When you're scrolling through social media and you see your own birth all over the internet. That deep. But we've got to talk about Alabama for a second. She's been living that fame life for as long as we can remember, and she was already stirring the pot with her content way before she was 18. But we also know it hasn't exactly been going well. We've covered it before, Alabama out here on TikTok, dressing in outfits that had people raising their eyebrows way before she even turned 18, and the vibes in her posts have been chaotic, to say the least. Of course, she's been criticized for her behavior online, and honestly, we can't help but look back and say, Travis? Shanna, this is kinda on y'all. Alright, moving on. Now, while Travis hasn't technically banned Alabama from TikTok, let's not get ahead of ourselves, sources are saying he's been taking a more active role in her life and may have told her to cool it with the social media antics. And honestly, it's about time. With Alabama being exposed to fame and attention for so long, it's clear that this girl needed someone to reel her in. But remember, we had shockingly uncovered that Travis used to review and approve all of Alabama's posts, which is something most people have never gotten over, because we all know the kind of stuff that she has posted in the past. Still on the overexposure debate, remember her dad even liked those photos. Yes, let that sink in, he saw his daughter in those teeny tiny outfits and double tapped with okay. no hesitation. <laughs> It's honestly giving Hollywood dad not caring about his kids' boundaries. We're talking about photos that have Alabama looking like she's trying to break into a adult career path, if you catch my drift. Fans were always left in shock because Travis was clearly being neglectful or just too busy to even care at this point. In the same interview, Travis talked about how he's handling things very differently with his new baby, Rocky. He said he's not letting little Rocky be exposed to the same chaos his older kids went through. They have never even let Rocky's face get posted online. But here is the craziest part of all of this. While Travis might have seen the light and would like to have Alabama on a social media hiatus, she'll likely put up a fight because why now? We'll soon be waking up to news that she's telling her friends she feels like her dad is too controlling and that she's old enough to handle herself. And let's not forget, Landon and Alabama's mom, Shanna Mokler, have had 
plenty of drama of their own over the years. Shanna, who's had her own share of public controversies, was reportedly just as lenient with Alabama's social media behavior. Some sources even say she encouraged it. So it looks like Travis is stepping up to clean up the mess and finally give Alabama some boundaries, even though it might be a little too late. Of course, many people are glad that Rocky is getting a better, more mature, grounded father, but Kourtney Kardashian agreeing to this arrangement is the real miracle. I mean, she's a Kardashian. They can neither spell nor define privacy because being on camera is their full-time business. In fact, people faulted Kourtney just as they called out Alabama's real parents when they let her lose her mind online. People assumed she was just an attention-seeking spoiled brat until recently when everyone was like, wait a damn minute, this kid does all these under her parents' roof. Three parents! She was supposed to be the stabilizing stepmom that helped keep Alabama grounded, but Courtney's been low-key looking the other way while all of this storm keeps brewing, and has always stayed silent on this matter despite constantly sharing photos of her and Alabama having a good time. They seem comfortable enough to have all sorts of talks, so Courtney has no excuse use for not pointing out Alabama's dress code and social media presence. But she stayed silent, just more focused on her new Kardashian Barker family vibe. So people are starting to say that Courtney is no longer a stepmom. She's basically Alabama's influencer coach. Yikes. If you ask me, Travis might just be doing damage control. Some fans are already side-eyeing Travis, wondering why he's bringing this up now that Alabama and Landon are practically grown. Like, bruh, you should have had this kind of energy when they were kids. It feels like he's trying to shift blame off of himself for how his kids turned out on social media. We've seen Alabama getting dragged before for her wild outfits and over-the-top posts, and Landon isn't exactly keeping a low profile either. If Travis was really so concerned about how they've been acting online, he should have stepped up earlier because he knew he lived with them under the same roof. Now, some fans might argue that it's better late than never, but others are straight up calling it hypocritical. He's been all about that rock star lifestyle, and let's be honest, that's probably rubbed off on his kids. Alabama and Landon didn't grow up in some average household. They were living the celebrity life from day one. Looks more like saving his own image than actually helping his kids. Not only that, Alabama and Landon have already built their social media personas. Alabama especially has a massive following and has become kind of infamous for her rebellion edgy content. Unless Travis plans on doing a complete 180 and trying to micromanage their social media, which we all know won't go over well, there is not much he can do now except give advice. But we all know that once you're grown and making your own money, that parental advice starts to sound like background noise. Another thing that fans are buzzing about is how celebrity parents like Travis seem to put their careers over their kids. It is no secret that a lot of celeb kids are always raised by nannies and they grow up with more freedom than they should have. They are handed fame and fortune on a silver platter, but zero guidance. They literally pop in and out as long as they provide every material thing the kids need. And one day, they wake up to the harsh realization that they are total strangers to their grown babies. Travis, being the cool rock star dad, might have let his kids have too much freedom too soon. Fans are debating whether he was more concerned with being seen as the cool dad than actually setting boundaries. It doesn't make sense why most of them never want to look like the strict old school parents because they have an image to maintain too. Forgetting that image is for fans. Well, being cool comes at a cost and Travis has learned this the hard way. Oh, and another thing, and this is a little deeper. If Travis truly wanted to be a better parent, he would also try to get his kids to have a better relationship with their mom, Shayna Mokler. The uncomfortable truth is that he played a major role in making Alabama and Landon prefer Kourtney Kardashian over their biological mother. Shayna has even admitted in the past that co-parenting with Travis is near impossible because he is always in this competition mode, always trying to one-up her instead of actually working together for the sake of the kids. Like, he wants to be the cool parent, and she just gave up trying. If he was really serious about fixing the family dynamics, he should be encouraging the kids to foster a healthy relationship with Shayna. Until that happens, this is all just smoke and mirrors. This whole competition with Shayna raises even more eyebrows, because now it looks like Travis is just trying to win in the parenting game, or kind of like he wants to prove that his way is better, and Shayna's opinion 
wins don't really matter. But that's a bad look, especially since Alabama and Shayna aren't on the best terms. Alabama lives with Travis and Courtney, and fans are questioning if that's because they allow her to do whatever she wants, while well, Shayna would probably enforce more rules. Obviously, kids like places where they don't have to follow strict rules, so of course Alabama's going to prefer staying with her dad. Shayna also once mentioned that the Kardashian influence negatively impacted her babies, but there was nothing she could have done about it. All in all, fans are left wondering if Travis's new concern for his kids is truly heartfelt or just a way to avoid blame for how they've turned out. He did drop the ball as a parent when Alabama and Landon were younger, and now he's scrambling to pick it back up. This could be also a way just to shift focus from the fact that he hasn't always made the best choices when it comes to guiding his kids. It is a complicated situation, and one thing is for sure. He had been silent all along until he got called out. It is no news that people have been saying how much baby Rocky is taking priority. Now, parenting is hard, especially when you've got a teenager and a newborn at the same time, but fans have legit started wondering if Travis didn't know all along that Alabama needed guidance from present parents. Also, if he actually regrets it, then we should be seeing a totally different picture on Alabama's TikTok. But as of the time I was making this video, nothing had changed. Knowing Alabama, there is no chance she will dial back. She's got that rebellious streak. Anyways, the Barker Kardashian drama is far from over, and we'll be here to see if Travis did mean his words. What do y'all think? Let me know down below. Thanks loves for watching, and see you in the next video.